Okay, there will be people we can do better than that. Let me say that again. Free, free! Palestine! Palestine! Free! Palestine! Free! Palestine! Palestine! Free! 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 Palestine! For so long that you've been across times, it's become historic. We are now living through historic times. And these historic times are what will be written in the books of history going forward. So first of all, I'd like to say a big thank you and congratulations to you all for standing on the right side of history. Give us another round of applause. Courage, courage is our currency. And truth is our weapon. We need to move forward in the, in the hope and with the strength to understand that collectively we can achieve a lot more. For the past 75 years, the dark clouds of ethnic cleansing and genocide have been looming over the people of Gaza and Palestine in general. Enough is enough. Enough was enough 75 years ago. We're still standing here today talking about it. And it's time to create massive changes. Time to get rid of the shackles of colonial mindsets. It's time to get rid of the chains that tires to people from our families, our cousins, our Chachide Kutter, if you understand Urdu, or our Masir, just because they stand with Labour or because they stand with Conservatives. That's not it anymore. How many times have you seen our own people who claim to stand for our rights but have failed to make the change? How many times? All the time. How many times have you heard people say, we need to create change from within. We need to fight from within. How many times has that been successful? Name me one time that's been successful. It's never been successful. It's time for a change and we have to become that change. But the people who are uh, involved in politics, the Tory and the Labour parties, a message to them, your complicity is not going unnoticed. It's not going to be gone unpunished either. We see you, we hear you and we observe you. We see how blind you are to the atrocities that are taking place. We hear how deaf you become to the cries of him and all the children who are carrying the limbs of their siblings in carrier bags under the rubble waiting for assistance. That's not good enough. We are not going to pay our taxes for our money to be used as part of this genocide. To our fellow protesters, stay strong. We have to stay strong. These getting together do not go unnoticed. Like Kabir said, me, Kabir, uh, Brother Zohur and some of others from Burton, we went into Cairo to help the refugees of Palestine there. They see you, they hear you, they, they get encouragement and strength from you. So never underestimate the getting together of the people, no matter how small or big it is. The last thing I would like to say is that Palestine was then, Palestine is now, and Palestine will be forever. Free, free! Palestine! Free, free! Palestine! Free, free! Palestine! Free, free! Palestine! Free, free! Palestine!